in the spring and so this is when we start seeing that type of weather we just showed you there in the deep south very active day there we are dealing with cold weather now it's the same system that's bringing us cold weather that's bringing the deep south severe storms we are just going to stay dry overnight but frigid the coldest night so far this winter Temperatures right now are cold enough. It's freezing in Fort Worth. It feels like 20 because we have a breeze out there that's been between 15 and 25 miles an hour all day. Temperatures will continue close to freezing for the next several hours, and of course, it will feel colder than that. The actual temperature will dip to 22 by tomorrow morning. And again, that will be the coldest number for winter, but it's going to feel like it's between 0 and 10 when you head out the door tomorrow morning. And unfortunately, it's just not going to warm up a whole lot during the day tomorrow. We'll have a lot of clouds on Monday. It's going to stay dry, but temperatures will only top out at 34 tomorrow afternoon. And look at these wind chills, single digit wind chills the entire morning. And during the afternoon, it's going to feel like it's in the teens. Tomorrow is a day to stay indoors, but you also need to prepare for this type of hard freeze both Monday morning and Tuesday morning. The four P's people, make sure all your friends, especially your elderly friends or neighbors, have warmth. Pets need to be brought inside. Plants covered or brought inside. And those outdoor pipes or faucets need to be covered in order for them to not burst. This is certainly pipe bursting weather. Shut off the automatic sprinklers as well. You don't want a sheet of ice on the neighborhood streets tomorrow morning if the sprinklers go off. Here's a look at it on the future sky forecast. Partly to mostly cloudy overnight, 22. Now notice this up here in Oklahoma. I can't completely rule, uh, rule out a couple of flurries up toward Gainesville or Sherman tomorrow morning. No accumulation, no problems with that, but just don't be surprised. We're going to stay dry tomorrow, just breezy and cold with a high of only 34. Another hard freeze coming up by Tuesday morning when we bottom out at 23. Tuesday, we're still chilly, a high of 43. We get a little warmer on Wednesday with temperatures back in the 50s, but keep in mind, this time of year, the normal high is 64 degrees. We're nowhere close to that over the next several days. So how about some warmer thoughts? How many days until spring starts? 17, 25 days until Rangers opening day. 49 days until Easter Sunday, so at least we can at least think warm thoughts. And actually, by the end of this week, the temperatures will start going into spring territory with the south wind starting on Thursday and going into Friday. Temperatures will finally get above normal for next weekend. Anything but above normal tomorrow with the temperatures. Frigid temperatures in the lower 20s tomorrow morning, 34 the high, 43 on uh, Tuesday, 53 Wednesday. But look at this, back in the upper 70s Friday. And how about 80 on Saturday? Now, there will be a 50% chance of thunderstorms next Saturday. We'll have to keep an eye on that next Sunday's highs in the mid 60s. That is